<sighs> All right, let's get this intro started. Um, All right, so I got a little trick for you guys here. And we're going to use the three of diamonds. And so we'll take the three and watch, watch. And switch it for the four of hearts. Hey, what's going on guys? Max here and today we're gonna be doing a reaction video to a really good comedic magician. But first, I just wanna update you guys. The giveaway winner has been picked. Winner will be in the description below. I also have emailed you. If you receive the email, please get back to me with your info as soon as possible and I will get you the black deck of bicycle playing cards. Thank you all of you guys for entering. It was great. I had a great response, great interaction. I love love seeing all the comments and likes on the video. Yeah, so just really thank you guys for entering. I just want to also let you know, stick around because we're close to hitting a thousand subs. I'm so excited and I'll be doing a much bigger giveaway for that. I'll be giving away uh, probably uh, close to a brick of playing cards. So if you love cards, stick around, you could win. So on to what we are going to be talking about today, what you all came for. We're going to be looking at a very special magician. Yeah, um, his name is Ryan Hayashi. Hayashi. I cut that part. Ryan Hashi, he's this great magician. A couple of you guys told me to go check out his video on Penn and Teller. I've heard of Ryan Hashi before. I heard that he's actually really funny, but he's also like very technical and great sleight of hand magician. So not only is he a comedic magician, he has great skills. Let's get uh, right into it. Let's see what he's got for us. Six Let's languages. Six right languages. <laughs> oh my gosh. She's so cringy. When I was a kid, I had two Ooh. heroes, Bruce Lee and David Copperfield. <laughs> Those are some great heroes. That cringy. I, I feel like this guy's very talented just by seeing like his intro. I cut up vegetables around people's heads. Wow. Without killing. <laughs> Without killing, well, I hope you didn't kill anybody, Ryan. Uh, that would be really bad. But already watching like his intro, he seems very skilled in other art forms. So I'm very interested to see what he's got. Now, I'm shedding my samurai character and stripping down my performance to magic in its purest form, showing off what I can do with a few coins that fit in my pocket. Mm, so he's gonna be doing some coin magic. Ah, uh, the coin matrix. Okay. I really hope this audio is okay because I know there's an echo in here, but. That's Japanese for time to get my freak on. Time to get his freak on. It's not like I was watching Ninja Warrior. I saw Penn and Teller on television performing an act with just a pencil and a cigarette. This act fooled me and taught me the basics of magic. So, Penn. Teller, huh. I now present to you what you inspired in me 30 years ago. Hmm. I'm going to hurt your brain <laughs> using He's these four, hurt our brains. four coins in an original routine I call the Ultimate Matrix. In just a moment, these coins are going to magically appear and disappear, changing their positions around the square, wow. traveling from their corners to all come together, gathering here in this corner and landing underneath this square, and if I can create the illusion right. that those coins move without let's see, it, my let's hands, see his so performance then, on this. I'm really interested. Just fool you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I need to pay better attention because you already got me there. This is magic in its purest and simplest form. Four coins in a square. Okay. A card over each coin. Watch closely because this does happen very fast. Hi, <laughs> And I just did it. <laughs> not a problem. Everybody, do not blink your eyes. And uh, I'll just do it one more time. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Look at Teller. One one. He's like, and wow. I've never seen Teller like that. I'll start here openly so you can see everything. Everybody, watch this coin travel. 
That's insane. Oh my god. He is so clean. His handling is so clean. Like, this is mind blowing. <laughs> see what I mean? This guy is really this funny. Visibly, so you actually see each coin jump. This is the part that hits people hard. All I have to do is make the mysterious Asian sound. <laughs> There's the first one. <laughs> the Asian sound. I'll do it again. <laughs> and that makes three. <laughs> the next one. No hands, just because I can. Here, reappears in the corner, and I'm in peace. <laughs> I love this guy. I'm in beast mode. What the? This time, no cards, just my bare hands and a dose of honesty. I've been performing magic since I was eight years old. Oh my and god, it took me 12 years to create this act. So, for me, this is not just a magic trick, this is something far deeper. And a thousand times more savage. <laughs> a work of terrifying beauty that has been growing all my life like an uncontrollable weed in the garden of my mind. <laughs> Why haven't I watched this video before? <laughs> oceans of time and vast empires to be here today. So I take the honor of performing here very seriously. The amount of mental energy I've invested in creating this act could demolish planets. This is the most epic monologue in the history of magic, for I am here to inflict psychological damage. <laughs> Passing halfway through. Ryan Ayoshi is insane. Like, he's just saying the craziest stuff so funny. <laughs> He's just literally destroying me with his magic right now. Like, I cannot keep up at all. I just need, I need a drink, I need a drink of water, man. This video is gonna be like 15 minutes long, I'm sorry. Ryan, just show me more, please. We're not done yet. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can generate using two hands. Let's take this to the next level. I'll do it again with just <laughs> one hand. He's devastating. You can ask any magician around the world about performing an illusion this clean using just one hand, and they will tell you that it is physically impossible. And it looks like this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. He is ridiculous. With my hand, and still vanishes from here. Here's in the corner, and I am the Jackie Chan of magic. <laughs> the Jackie Chan of magic. The next one will invisibly fly from here to there, forming a perfect square. Oh it my god. On the count of three. Get ready for this. I've seen it all. Nosebleed, seizures. There's one. <laughs> There's two. That's three. I'm gonna have a nosebleed after watching this. This is not a dream. Never give up. This is honestly insane. Living your dream and doing something every day to make that dream happen. But remember one thing: no matter who you are, no matter how hard you work, or how good you think you are at what you do, there will always be an angel who takes it to the next level. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my gosh. That was insane. <laughs> that was really incredible. I didn't know if I wanted to look at you or just watch Teller be so amazed. I mean, Teller was stunned. Like, you really are the 
He had no clue what was going on. I had no clue what was going on. He just keeps going. It never stops. Please ask me a question. Okay, what do you eat for breakfast? Because I need to start eating. I live on broccoli and blueberries. Can I say something? <laughs> Can I say something really honest to Penn and Teller? Um, uh, when I was a kid, they really they blew me away with this act they do with a pencil. And they didn't have any being able to come here today, I've never met them before today, and show this to them. It's not me showing my work. It's showing them uh, the effect uh, one act on TV can have on a little kid, you know? It's like bringing it back that's, to them and saying, well, That's very inspiring. Yeah, I like that. He's, he's now gone out of his act mode and more into his... Like very, honest. Very I googled the show this is season five and the last four seasons before me. 240 performers on this stage, only three coin guys before me. That, that means something. It's hard to put a coin hmm. act together. Well, I didn't know that. Uh, I tried my best. I, I hope it resonates. Yeah, yeah, I guess you don't see many coin acts on um, Penn and Teller. I don't. That's interesting. Oh, Ryan, baby. Boy, that's a. Wow. It's done. It's just like. That's a really good act. And uh, <laughs> you were just saying how hard. Coin magic is to do it. We've done versions of Matrix, what Tella has, and uh, we've seen Matrix uh, a zillion Damn, times. This is next you added to that level. So, so, um, so much comedy and personality, and also a really different, fresh way to do that, a fresh style, the um, bravado yeah. coupled with the comedy on that, the wink on every bit of it. And we were, uh, you know, we were following you, uh, and then we followed you along. And then we know how it do those moves and we followed you and followed you and then we <laughs> we just gave up yeah <laughs> she just beat us in the like, with pure skill this is insane so the I, last few things you did I we had no idea how you did them because we were so just, just enjoying so it too much and you fooled us yeah oh, well, I mean I don't know how I understand that yeah they could probably keep up with him for like a certain amount of time. All right, it's over. Um, I understand that they could, Penn and Teller could keep up with him because they know how that trick is done. I personally don't know much about coin magic, so that to me is just astonishing. Like, I really don't know how he moves. I mean, I can follow some things because I'm familiar with sleight of hand, but Ryan Hayashi, two thumbs up, man, you crushed that. Like, that was insane. So, the, the combo of his comedic performance and his sleight of hand performance, like those together, this is one of my favorite acts I've ever seen, honestly. Like his personality is so funny to me and I love his jokes and sense of humor, it's great. So that was fantastic, really enjoyed that. Thanks for recommending me to watch that video. Um, if you have any other videos you want me to react to, let me know in the comments down below. And I had lots of fun on this one. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up. Don't be afraid to smack that subscribe button and we'll catch you in the next one. I had to go fast because I'm on low battery. See ya, peace.